So, Africa and India, a continent and a country. These two guys have more similarities than how you thought. If you want to know more about that, stay together so that we talk. So I am Britain from Congo in Africa and I came in India two and a half years back. I came with some of my expectations and well, what I met in India was totally different from what I was thinking I'm going to live in India. So I've got so many similarities among Indians, which I saw that these things are exactly the same things which we live in Africa. There are so many, but I'm just going to give five, which according to me, five, not five, five, which according to me are some of the things which are too much similar between Africa or well, I can say Congo where I am from with India. First thing, parenting, using sleepers, broomstick, a remote control or anything which is around are some of the things which are usually used by African parents to beat children and well I came to see that is the same thing also in India. Parents being strict with their children, not allowing them to move sometimes, going out and doing this. There are so many similarities which sometimes might not be exactly the same and it can vary from one family to another but yet I found that there are so many similarities between the way of parenting in Africa as parenting in India. And if you have been in a a normal family probably one time you have been beaten by a sleeper because you stole sugar i think you can understand what i'm trying to say second thing the family relationship little bit different than the western life i saw that both in india as in africa you must know all your cousins all those brothers and sisters from far and from close the brother of the young sister of the aunt of your uncle the one who was born in the family of the brother-in-law of your sister like you just have to know everybody in the family it be close or far so you see that there is this broad relationship which comes in the family which maybe because of the western world we are trying to copy it more nowadays of forgetting about our cousins or all those who are close to our families but what i have seen is that both in african families as in indian families people try as much as they can to be close to those families which can be far or close i think you just understand me and sometimes there are those uncomfortable times when you meet people who you never knew and your mother is telling you this is your cousin and like i've never seen them i don't know anything about them how come they're just my cousin third thing choosing a life career. Of course, this is everywhere on the planet. Like parents still have the strict way of asking children to follow a certain career because they think it's more successful. But yes, I saw that in Africa as in India, it's still at a high scale that most of the careers which we usually go for are doctors, lawyers, engineers, and maybe some others which you know. But obviously something which concerns arts is just like losing your life. Nobody's going to allow you. And that is, I'm the first example for that. I wanted to be a filmmaker and I even reached the point of taking registration in a filmmaking school but my parents never allowed me here i am doing engineering four money economy have you ever seen that situation where your mother buys something for you and she wants you to dress it for like next 10 years okay not 10 years like five years next they will literally buy something which is really huge for you so that you can grow up in it so there are just those practices which we have and i saw that even some parents some indian parents also have it whereby they don't want to waste money on everything that they have to buy something which they're sure that is going to last for long and little expenses which you may have they have to cut them just to make sure that they save more money and of course that's the almost same which happens also in africa and like i even developed that behavior of when i order food online and i have a container i don't throw the container i wash it and keep it i knew that's from my mother and i was talking recently to one of my indian friends who told me that she does also the same thing she can't throw containers which she used before and i just understood that there there is also a certain similarity in a way of being economic on everything fit is liberty being married or still at home there is always a way your parents are going to enter your life so literally there is no way you can be grown up enough to be free to do everything which you want it may not be exactly similar in all families or in all countries but i've seen that we always have that thing to give back to our parents or that control which they always have on us it may not be directly from parents but just from family or just people who are around you everybody have to be a spy on you everybody have to check on your life everybody have to know what's going on in your life and i saw that it's something which 
is almost similar again in Africa, people will literally be spy on you, especially neighbors. They have to know everything which happens. Even if you don't have cameras to see who always enter your house, your neighbors can tell you who always enter your house. So there is that there is no enough liberty for you to say that you can do everything which you want because everyone has an eye on you. So these are just few points which I gave, which I think are similarities between India and Africa. But there are still so many in languages, in behaviors, there are just so many things which shows how Africa and India are similar or they have so many similarities. So thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you got again something more which you, le which you learned here. If you want to learn more, or if you want to hear me more of speaking of my experiences, you can follow or find uh, Muhombo Live, which the link will be in the description. If you want to watch other Africans who are here in India and who make content about their life here in India, you can find also the link of everything in the, in the descriptions. Thank you so much for being here. Catch you next time.